Right, so I wanted to talk about um, spectral manipulations using raster functions in ArcGIS Pro. All right, so here have a, an image. This is a four-band image, CR image of the uh, from the National Agricultural Imagery Program for the air around Kingwood, West Virginia, in Preston County. Um, and I just like to do some manipulation to this with some raster functions. Okay, so to open up the raster functions, we need to go to Analysis, and then Raster Functions. And then that will open up the raster function um, pane. And then what we're working with here specifically is conversion, and we're looking at the spectral conversion tool. Okay, so what is the use of this tool? Well, it's generally used if you want to do some type of transformation of raw data into new data using coefficients. Examples would be principal component analysis, where you want, could apply uh, you know, the eigenvalues to the bands and then get back your principal components, or maybe doing something like a tasseled cap transformation of a Landsat image. Um, so this is just a three-band image, or sorry, four-band image. So I'm just going to put in some numbers in here. Um, we don't really have coefficients to use. I'm just making some stuff up. And then let's just edge this off here. Okay, so there's some numbers. All right, so let's run that now. And you see we get this output image, which has been which has transformed the data into a different uh, different combination uh, are diff you know, a different space, a different spectral space. Um, so in short, the cool thing about this tool is that it allows you to take raw input data and then convert it into some new data using coefficients. And again, practical applications would be applying some type of principal component transformation or con conical po component transformation or something like a uh, tasseled cap transformation like for Landsat data to derive like brightness, greenness, and wetness from a uh, from from a uh, uh, from raw bands.